If you are found on the streets within the hours of the curfew without a curfew pass, you would be called upon to justify your whereabouts, commission a grave red eye flight, or an emergency of a serious nature. If it is you have to immediately leave your home to go to the hospital, you need to accompany your loved one. If the police stop you, they are actually going to escort you to that location. You have the right to ask a police officer to produce his or her ID and badge number during the course of interaction. Your curfew pass should be displayed on the upper or lower corner of your front windshield. Police retain the right to seize curfew permits if there is misuse. Alicia Boucher, TV6 News. If I go home now and I can't, I, I can't be able to stand up because I stand up for a whole after. Right? I don't. You may waste my time. We all we have enough food. It's a we don't want to be fed and dead. All restaurants and bars will be closed. Two, all malls would be closed. Three, all places of worship would be closed. All gyms and fitness centers will be closed. All spas, hairdressing, locations and beauty dispensing areas will be closed to the public what is the difference tell me what is the difference if and we are saying to the population again for the days ahead as described so from midnight tonight Trinidad and Tobago will be under a state of emergency involving a curfew that from then onwards would be 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. Meaning that if you don't have to be out for exempted reasons, you stay home under force of law however it is not feasible to shut down a country who is mad enough to have money in the bank approved vaccine has been used in 57 countries with 65 million doses administered while given the all clear for the 18 and over category the 60 and over category those with comorbidities and those living with hiv there's one group tnt will be holding out on although w that is holding on that particular subgroup we will have deliberations through the tag group 
and through the Director of Women's Health in the coming weeks to determine how we move forward. But for now, we are holding on that subgroup, lactating women at this time. Trinidad is holding on that particular... The interval between shots is three to four weeks, which Dr. Paris Ram says will assist in TNT getting to herd immunity faster. The vaccine has a 79% efficacy, 14 or more days after receiving the second jab. So we have to be mindful that if you have one dose of either this vaccine or the other vaccine, it one doesn't give you the optimal effect, and two, you can still get COVID-19. How does the vaccine perform when it comes to variants of concern? There was a little decrease in the effect for the South African variant, but the other variants it hasn't been evaluated against. Finance Minister Carmen Boot said last week the Ministry of Health placed a No vaccine. Please don't do that. It is not necessary. Spread it out. Stay at home. Stay away from people. If you do that, you will minimize the chances. I can't give you any guarantee, but it gives you the best chance of not being infected, giving Take some and leave the rest. Is thanking those persons who have to go out those essential workers. The old talk shouldn't be selfish about ourselves and our comfort and our need to be treated specially. And how sensible would that have been? Emergency that took effect on Sunday is different to those in 1970, 1990, and 2011, as this one is specifically meant to deal with the health threat posed by the ongoing COVID surge in Trinidad and Tobago. And therefore, it is obviously a sensible equation that those regulations receive careful attention because they have to be carefully balanced. But the state of emergency is not only about the government's mantra during the pandemic of saving lives while maintaining livelihoods. It is also about the impact it will have on rights enshrined in the Constitution, including rights involving private property. So the Trinidad week, sometimes five days and sell nothing. This Saturday, you're praying that you sell something because the sending lawyer, um, letters from upstairs stating what you rent, otherwise, you will get locked down. It's unfair for business people what they have to go through. Couple questions and we're done. Five people dead, one dead, sometimes, some days, nobody dead. So we can do what we want. We will do what has to be done. And what is it you want so that you have to go there every day? It's open all the time for reasonable hours. From 6 in the morning till 8 in the evening. Every day. To do that is to bring about exactly what we don't want. Because if you do that, when it opens, the rush is going to be there because it's going to be closed or it's going to be open. It's open all the time for reasonable hours from 6 in the morning till 8 in the evening every day. What is it you want so that you have to go there every day in such large numbers that that becomes the place of potential infection? I also want to...